As we head into week nine of our pandemic existence, just wanted to check in again and let you know we're thinking of you. And as you know, we've been doing the COVID-19 shows on Tuesday nights. We thought we'd do one or two, and now we're into the 10th one this week. I don't really think that we thought it was going to be. No, never. That long. And we've talked to a lot of frontline people, doctors, nurses, responders, but you know, we were talking today, Gabe and I, and, and really just want to hear from you how you're coping on a day-to-day -day, uh, basis, getting kids educated, surviving, mental health issues. Working, not working, um, you know, being disconnected from family and friends that you see on the regular that, you know, that's a normal part of life. We asked you guys a couple weeks ago how you guys were doing and the comments back um, we we can relate to you know we we're feeling it too we're feeling it with you we're feeling it for you um, you know we, we everybody talks about their the physical health and staying healthy but I think the mental part of this has really kicked in oh yeah and I think we'd like to hear from you to maybe be on the show and talk about some of this stuff so if you have some feelings or or want to share some things you know touch base here on the YouTube channel or uh, official Chris Hansen on uh, Instagram or at Chris Hansen on Twitter. Um, we'd like to hear and we'll sort through them and, and as we put together the show for next Tuesday, we'll, we'd like to include some of that, I think. Yeah, you're going back to New York on Sunday. That's going to be a little weird, I'm going to be honest with you. You know, I've been here for going on nine weeks now and we're back and forth all the time anyway, um, but obviously we need to have a New York presence. We've got the television studio built in the basement, so we're mm -hmm. set there. But. It's gonna be a uh, strange way back because I think we're you're gonna really look gonna down feel on it. I think yeah. being here feels well, some things don't feel that different, but right. I think when you go back there, where there's such a buzz all the time, Manhattan's just gonna be different. It's not business oh. as usual. I left on the twelfth, and you can still TV. Get around. I think it's gonna feel. Oh, yeah. I, I think it's. I think it's gonna be emotional. Um, we have our emotional days here, just like everybody else does. But you know, when you live in the suburbs, you don't feel it as much. Living in you know, a city like New York. Right, and the two youngest are here, and mm -hmm. two oldest are on their own, but you know, yeah. obviously we keep in touch every day, but it'll it'll be odd to be in the apartment. I mean, that's normal life. Like they don't, you know, they're, they're, they have real jobs and real lives, and um, that's always kind of like a check-in. So, you know, um, again, sometimes things feel normal, and other days it just really hits you on how different this is. And we'll get to see what I really left in the refrigerator and how that looks yeah. after eight weeks. <laughs> I'll keep you guys posted. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the least of our worries. So you guys take care. Have a wonderful weekend. Try and get some rest mentally and physically and maybe a little exercise along the way. We're thinking about you. We'll see you soon on the TV and the YouTube channel right here.